Welcome to Fraser Mac Gaming, I'm Fraser Mac. Today I'm going to be showing off the Onanaki demo that's obviously from Square Enix and Tokyo RPG Factory. If this is your first time on the channel I'd really appreciate if you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications and even tell a few of your friends. I'm kind of trying to push to grow the channel. I'm hovering around 100 subscribers which is kind of first milestone for me but you know please share it around, hit that subscribe button and obviously I'll get on with talking about the game now. So if you've seen my August video um, announcing the top Switch games, this is one obviously I'm really keen to play and when a demo was announced I thought it was fantastic. It's a great way to introduce a new IP, um, obviously an action RPG to the West and just generally to Switch owners around the world. So Onanaki, more of an action RPG, has some dark undertones in the story. I don't want to give too much away as you'll see it for yourself. Before we get into the gameplay, I want to let you know obviously I've played through the demo a few times uh, on different settings, so I've played it around a little bit. I've played it previously on the more casual and the kind of normal difficulty level, so what you will see after this, I'm going to give too much away, but it is in the maniac level because I didn't see too much challenge in the, the, the combat going through the kind of regular enemies and things like that, at playing through in the normal level, so I wanted to see have they kind of made the demo more comfortable to get you into it and let you play through it or is there going to be different challenge levels in the game that you know more experienced people can can jump into and, and really feel like they're challenged and they, they have to really push to get to the end of the story and progress. We'll see some quite comedic results of me pushing and trying to test the difficulty levels but it's something I'm really looking forward to playing. I don't think it's been pushed enough. I think it's obviously it's a new IP, so it's struggling to kind of break through. But Square Enix are really pushing those classic IPs, the classic Dragon Quest games, the builders and Dragon Quest XIS. I'll get into the game now. As you'll see, I'm going to play on Maniac, which is probably unadvisable for most people. And you'll probably see the results that there are huge jumps in difficulty. Um, the difference, I think, in the, the levels is that you get more health drops, etc., on the easier levels. But without further ado, I'll let you get into the story, enjoy it without further interruption.静かに雨が降っていた。あの日、両親が死んだ。病気だった。集まった大人たちは口々に悲しんではいけないと俺に言い、思い出話と来世の期待を口にしていた。
君はあなたえなぜなにねえいやうんあれさあ《いいかい?》なぜそれは So good. Twenty years ago, that word meant to understand. ずいぶん後になってから俺がマイラの父親と同じ幾ともりになってからのことだ幾ともりは死者と聖者の間を取り持ついわば朝廷者の役割を担っているこの世とあの世を行き来し迷いと救済するのが幾ともりの仕事だ鬼人で戦いましょうカガチいける問題ないそっちはマイラに任せる
ありがとう。森よ。
あのね行きましょう。まだ倒れるわけには。
早く写しように戻りましょう世界渡りするぞ違いがないか探してみましょう<笑>気が出せる癒やし粉を使うこれからが本番よ力を貸すレベルアップだ。まだ倒れるわけには。
何かがありそうね。何かがありそうね。全てを貫いてみせましょう
置を置いて行ってしまうの<笑> So that was a look at the Oninaki demo it's obviously not the full element I thought it'd be fun just to show off what it was like in Maniac version、uh, obviously action RPG the combat Is、uh, there's some spikes and difficulty is probably the, the easy way to explain that. So, the normal enemies you come across fairly straightforward, you can cut through them even on Maniac. But, yes, get to the boss battles, and it's a whole different ball game. So, I'm going to be playing through it lots more, getting through the full demo, and、um, just enjoying that. I'll hopefully get some gameplay when the game actually comes out. But I hope you enjoyed the video. It'd be interesting to hear if you're going to pick it up, what you think of the game itself.、Um, interested to hear from more like experienced RPG players, what elements do you see from other games, maybe. If this is your first time on the channel, I'd really appreciate if you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. You won't miss any of my content then. But on an Aki, obviously, the demo is available on the eShop now, and you can actually pre order a physical copy in the UK, in the EU, US, Asia. You can get that direct from the Square Enix website or on Play Asia. It's obviously going to be around £45. I've already pre ordered mine, I'm looking forward to getting it. But I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you on the next one. <laughs>